In this video, we will explore how to create a new RET screen portfolio using data you already have. We'll then learn how you can keep your portfolio updated as new data becomes available. RET screen has lots of options when it comes to creating a portfolio from your data and keeping that portfolio updated. On the File worksheet, under the Portfolio page, you can see that we have Create from File under the RET screen Connect section. Each of these buttons launch a connector to enable quick and easy portfolio creation and updating. You can see that there are connectors for standardized RET screen templates, for data coming from Energy Star Portfolio Manager, Energy Cap, Metrics, Helios, Urgenet, and more. We continue to add other sources over time. Please contact us if you're interested in adding other data sources to RET screen Connect. Clicking on the title here opens the help manual, which describes the process and includes blank templates and some example files. There are also instructions for how to connect to data from certain systems, such as Energy Star Portfolio Manager. I have here some sample data for several facilities. This comes from the file example A in the help manual we just saw. As you can see, it includes information about each facility, information about all the meters in my facilities, including electricity, gas, water, and more, and the consumption data itself, including the dates and any cost data I want. The blank templates A and B have the same structure for you to put your data into. All kinds of data can be included in your portfolio, from occupancy, production levels, fleet mileage and usage, to user-defined tables, event logs, and more. Almost any kind of Excel file can be formatted or adapted, sometimes with macros you can write, to make it compatible with importing data. For now, I'll stick with this template. With this data ready, I'll click on RET screen template, choose this file, and indicate which folder I want it in. I'll click on OK, and you'll see in my folder that RET screen files are being created for each of my facilities, a portfolio file will be created, and a mapping file will also be created. The mapping file is an XML file that describes the relationship between the data source and RET screen files. This file is used by RET screen Connect to keep your portfolio updated. I'll skip ahead a few minutes until the portfolio is finished importing. Now that the importing is done, you can see that the portfolio is automatically created and populated with data until the end of the first quarter of 2020. RETScreen has created the RETScreen file, located the facility from the information in the Excel file, created the relevant consumption tables, and imported the existing utility data into each row. Now suppose it's the next reporting period and you want to update your portfolio and share updated reports. See here that I've updated my Excel file to include new data for up until the first quarter of the next fiscal year. There are a few ways to update your data. Since we created our portfolio using Create From File, RETScreen has everything it needs to update the existing files with new data. With my portfolio open, I'll click on the RETScreen Connect button here in the menu select the file with the updated data, and choose my mapping file so RETScreen knows where to put this data. The other options tell RETScreen where to find the new data, whether just to import new data or to clear and replace, whether to update all of the files or just a subset of them. This can be helpful when you have a portfolio with hundreds or thousands of facilities and only want to update some of them. I'll turn off updating the NASA near real-time satellite weather data to speed things along. I click on OK, and after a few moments, the data has been added to the files. This icon tells me that RETScreen has noticed that new data is available in the file and is ready to update the portfolio. Clicking on Refresh, I update the portfolio, and notice how the new data has been added. Now what if you wanted to update your portfolio but also had new facilities or new meters? RETScreen lets you do that by leveraging the Create From File again. I'll click on the RETScreen Template button, and this time, choose Update Existing Portfolio. Now, when RETScreen notices any new facilities or meters, it will add them to your portfolio.
notice that I now have this new facility in the province of British Columbia. Another convenient way to import data into your files for your portfolio is to add or import new data directly into each .retx file. We have a video on how to import data into RetScreen's performance analysis using the import button, but now RetScreen has the ability to directly connect to external data sources. To set this up, I'm going to open the individual facility RetScreen file I want to connect data to. On the data worksheet, click on the table you want to be the destination, then click on the data source button in the menu. You'll see that you can connect to several external data sources by using an OLEDB connection or by connecting to an SQL server. Or you can establish a direct connection with data monitoring systems like EcoStructure Power Monitoring Expert from Schneider Electric or Hydro Energy Monitor from Hydro Green Solutions. We will continue to add direct connection options as they become available. Let's suppose we have data in a database that we want to connect to. I'll type in my connection and query parameters and indicate which columns in my RetScreen table correspond to my query results. After the data is successfully connected, I can update my data within my files by clicking on the Update Data button, either just for this table or all connected tables in this file. And since this file is part of my portfolio, the icon beside the file in the portfolio indicates that it has a direct connection to its data source. And I can update that automatically from the portfolio by clicking on the Update Data button. You can see how RetScreen Connect enables you to create, update, manage, and connect your data. Having all these tools at your disposal will streamline the energy management process for your portfolio so you can spend more time managing energy and less time manipulating spreadsheets and formula.